Now, when we talk of strange in quartz, we, we cannot discount this deposit, the, the uh, Chibuku deposit in the Zambezi Valley, Zimbabwe. Look at that almost little black smile going across there like a kiss on the side of the crystal. Typically, the color on these would be a smoky amethyst, pretty dark amethyst, uh, and uh, the smoky would usually be patterning running through it. Now, from a crystallographic point of view, these are quite, quite mysterious. Uh, the forms are uh, between elestials and scepters, etc. It's, it's actually a study on its own. So now what, what I would take as the main termination, we first of all look at this angle. I'm very pleased to be able to do a video on this particular piece because the still pictures, I think once you've watched the videos, you'll understand the still pictures slightly better. Let's get this back in focus. So you have the, the crystal head going across here, going across here. Of course, multiple interesting crystallizations, sideways Lemurians there, going across there, crystalline across that section. So that would be looking from the top down. Then when we turn it over, we have crystallization running across here as well. Now there would have been an indentation of a, a former quartz crystal which sat there. I think it's, it's known as a key in esoteric terms. Going around like that. I think point of contact is here. So it may have sat on a stem. This could have been a scepter, the head of a scepter. Now we're going to look for color. And I think I'll take this clean angle over here. And let's just zoom in there. There you'll see the intense dark smoky amethyst uh, uh, underlying color. So with backlighting, you'll actually be able to see right through the sky. And you'll have this explosion of colors. Of course, rainbows too, as we move it around, you see all those um, internal fractures causing the light to break up in the rainbow spectrum colors. Uh, quite, quite marvelous. All the way from Zimbabwe, Zambezi Valley, Shangan Quartz.